for for anything. Um, it, it's it's more just a privilege to get to play for play for the play for my country, um, especially against Australia because there's quite a long quite a big rivalry between the two countries, um, and to beat them again in their own their own backyard quite convincingly was was quite nice. Um, but I guess to get some sort of recognition for for the part I played is 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 amazing and yeah it's a it's a real privilege <laughs> we knew that we pre prepared well for a good year or so in the build up to it so we knew that if we went out there and 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 played to the to our and played the best cricket that we could we would more than likely come away with with victories as opposed to the losses but to beat the mate nil was quite a big surprise you made what 499 runs at an average of 99.8 yeah. um, that's, yes. that's phenomenal how, how pleasing was it to to come away of that and uh, you know being named player of the series i can't really explain it really it's um like i said i don't i don't really play for i just got there to try and score runs and win cricket matches i don't really i don't really look at um i look kind of look at the average at the end of a season to kind of gauge whether it's been whether i've done enough um, personally, um, so I guess to kind of come away with with an average of 99.8 at the end of eight games was was quite a nice feeling. Um, but more, but, but the, the, the better feeling is knowing that I've that I've helped the team win cricket games. Um, so as, as as much as as it is a personal um, a personal feat, it's more of what the team was able to achieve. All the squad, the the players, the staff, they're incredibly supportive of each other. Um, and and I have to I have to thank them majorly. I can't think of a better team to be playing with and, and being in an international competition and um, yeah, getting to play for England with and being coached by. Um, yeah, it's 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 amazing. I can't think of many many organisations that are really focusing heavily on on disability cricket or cricket in, as a whole, as both the ECB obviously being being the big one, um, and I think it's amazing just how many lives are blessed with cricket. And people think it's a boring sport until they play it, and they realise just how how amazing it can be. And even in the period that we're going through at the moment, um, it's it's amazing to see. How many young young cricketers there are, um, and yeah, it's phenomenal. I, I, I hope it continues for the long run. <laughs> I like to think of myself as some some sort of a role model for for any young person that wants to play cricket or any young person in general. Um, my normal life job is I'm a youth worker, and I try and try and be a role model for as many of those people that that come through our doors as possible. Um, but I just I just love playing cricket, and I love seeing people play cricket and. I love coaching people who love to play cricket. <laughs> so, so it's yeah, it's 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 just an amazing, amazing thing to be a part of.